Hello everyone! Episode 5 of Falls of Friday, a little bit of a special one. Because there was a little bit of a mention in the news about the blueprint for the 2017 Gen 2 rules in regards to the Australian V8 supercars. Essentially there won't be V8 supercars anymore. It will potentially allow, as I'm reading here, four-cylinder turbo and six-cylinder turbo engines. That could mean we could see the return of Godzilla. So that's what I'm going to do today. We're going to do one hot lap of Mount Panorama. Bathurst, oh. I've got opponents on. It doesn't matter because I've got the drive off the line. I was hoping to do just one warm-up lap. And then absolutely just go for it. But no, nope, sod it. We are doing it live. Little bit squarely under braking. Could probably do with just a little bit more contact patch at the rear. Whoa, go around there. You can see already Godzilla has just left them for dead, but you can find... Whoa! I just stuffed that up. Completely and utterly. I guess I suppose now I am so far in ahead, I can treat this a bit like a warm-up lap. And just get used to everything, but... To know why Godzilla is so apt at this stage and why we could see it back. This is a 1993 Skyline GTR V-Spec, which is, it's probably not the exact car. I mean, I've done some upgrades to it to get it into the same racing bracket in Forza Motorsport 5 as the, um, as the V8 supercars you can drive in the game. Go on, get around there. But it's probably not an exact replica of Godzilla, but it's about as close as I'm personally going to get it with my knowledge of vehicles, because I'm a gamer, I'm not a mechanic, I'm not a car nut, I just know how to appreciate a good vehicle. And this is quite possibly one of the best. to grace Mount Panorama. I know I'm not the best driver. But that doesn't really matter. Well, a little bit slidey. Come on, keep it together. Slight tap on the brakes. Edge it round. Give it the berries. Brake at the top of the ridge. Back steps out just a wee way. Onto the brakes. As we go down. Down the mountain. A oh, little bit on the slidey there. That's okay, doesn't matter. Still got it together. Power down. No, there were only two years that 
Godzilla officially raced in the Bathurst 1000 and both years it absolutely smacked everyone out of the park. It was just a superior vehicle with superior drivers in it. And they got a little bit snooty about that and it became all holding forward, holding forward, holding forward. But no, with the 2017 rules coming in, we could very well see some Gen 2 awesomeness. And a 216, 229 on that one there. So what I think I might do is, oh my god, it's covered in crap. All the bugs and the dirt and the road grime and everything. Ugh, it just looks like absolute huckus, that poor car. That poor, poor car. Anyway, what we might do is we'll do a little comparison. So that was a 216. Let's get out one of the modern V8 supercars and we'll see if that compares to Godzilla. Okay, so now here we go with the Ford. I've turned off the opposing driver tires so I can just use this as a sighting warm-up kind of lap because I'm probably going to need it because I have a feeling that that Godzilla is going to absolutely monster me but at the same time I need to pull off a perfect lap in order to get it done quite properly so this first lap, we'll just take it easy, we'll get our sights in. And then, the second lap, I'll probably go a little bit quiet. Put the focus in and just absolutely go for it. So I've picked the FPR Falcon in the Xbox library. For this particular one, not that you can really see it from cockpit cam. I'll include some glam footage later of the replay. Maybe. Depends how much time I have to get it done. Already considering this is just a sighting lap. And I am no professional at this. Just bear that in mind. Totally not a pro. Here we go, so that's 216 there. Here we go. No, oh, my next rival is my old mate Craig. <laughs> This could be interesting. Whoa, a little bit squirrely. Oh, that didn't go too well. I back tapped the wall. Uh oh. Ah, oh, that's the wall. Damn it.
Here we go. Split time minus seven seconds. Even with the wall tap, holy crap. Sixteen, Godzilla's beaten me. That was what, two eighteen, two nineteen, roughly. Let's see if I can do any better in the competing Holden. All right, coming up into the chicane. Here we go. Slidey. On turn one, that will hurt my time. Then again, both the Ford and the Holden are both rear wheel drive V8 monsters. And of course, Godzilla is a twin turbo V, a twin turbo six cylinder. Can't remember if it's inline six or V6 in this particular case. I think it's I think it's V6, given it was the V-spec one I had. Ford couldn't match it. Oh, I'm in the wall again. Christ. That's probably half my problem. Can't get a clean lap in with this damn thing. But at the same time, though, this is a fairly clean lap. Certainly cleaner than what it was in the Ford. And this is the... Whoa! I've gone off! I've made a right hash of that! That will really hurt my time. Come on. in very very tight almost kissed the wall with the tail Full power around there, 205, 206. Oh, too late, too late, too late, too late. 212, 213, 214, 216. No, not gonna do it. 218, 219. <sighs> nope, didn't do it. It's no wonder that a lot of people are going to be so excited if Godzilla comes back to Bathurst in 2017. It could be quite amazing. Anyway, you guys can now enjoy some glam shots of those particular laps, and I will see you guys next week. <laughs> see ya.
果。